Welcome back people my people. Now today I'm going to do something and actually do an an uh, alcohol free. Okay, I've said it. Alcohol free review. And what I'm going to do is a review of an alcohol free product that is deeply related to the alcohol which I review. Okay. Today I'm reviewing the two tonic waters which you can see on the screen. There is the Bog Ordinary local home brand Woolworths uh, variety of tonic water and then there is the Fever Tree Mediterranean tonic water which is available worldwide. So for those of us in Australia you can pick up your tonic water at Woolworths it costs about $1.20 for 750ml and for the rest of the world Fever Tree Mediterranean it retails here for about $1.50 a 200ml bottle. Okay, so it's basically twice the two, it, it possibly two to three times the price of this stuff per 100 mils. I'm not precise. I just go, oh gee, this is a good idea. I go and buy it. So let's try them. Okay, I'm going to try the Fever Tree first up because that's the world standard. It's, if I start mentioning Fever Tree Mediterranean Tonic Water, the whole world is going to go, yep, Odin, I know exactly what you're talking about. And Odin being typical, the Odin needs to pop the lid off this baby. So. I use this as my main tonic to go to. It's my main mixer when I come to pre-war anything, alcohol, gin. It is citrus forward. It says so on the label that this is big on citrus. So if you have a flute citrus flavored gin or citrus flavored vodka, this will really bring out the lemon and the grapefruit in it. So you can see it's clear. Um, it bubbles. And it has um, looking for this. It's got carbonated water. I'm actually having trouble reading it. Fructose, which is fruit sugar, acid, citric acid, natural flavorings, including quinine, which makes, makes this an anti-malarial. Drink this in the tropics and you won't catch malaria. And that's about it. So down the hatch, it's nice and bubbly. It's not as strongly flavored as the Indian, which is also going to be reviewed. But yeah, like I said, when I feel like a good gin tea and I've got a dry gin, I tip this stuff into it. So, and this will be my base. Everything else is going to be compared to this. Very palatable, very workable, sold worldwide. Now, the other one, the Woolworths variety, I actually did drink the other day with a vodka and it works it certainly works um, it's not as bubbly but this has been open for a couple of days so let me say that show them down this is a workable tonic having said that let me say this in my true politician style It's a damn sight planer, okay? Um, and it should be noted that having tipped the Woolworths refreshing tonic water, enjoy a bubbly moment best mixed with friends with my vodka the other day. The next day I actually had a persistent hang headache and it wasn't due to the amount of vodka I drank. I have got a king size liver, trust me. God, you guys watch my channel, you know how big my liver is. So, between the two, the world standard, the Fever Tree Mediterranean Tonic Water, is actually the better because you get what you pay for. Um, if you're really screwed <laughs> for a tonic, this will work, the Woolworths one, but let's just say when my kids want to hit a tonic water, I won't be giving them too much Fever Tree Mediterranean, I'll be giving the Woolworths one simply so I can get it out of my house. So this is the first ever review of tonics. And like I say, the Fever Tree Mediterranean is gonna be absolutely the baseline standard because that's the one I drink the most of. Thank you people, my people, for watching and non-alcoholic review of my booze news and reviews.